Hello guys, welcome to another tutorial brought to you by Mike2 and for this tutorial I'm going to show you how to install Omega Room on your Galaxy Note 2. The prerequisite of this installation is that your phone must be rooted and also you need to back up your data with either titanium backup or any form of a backup facility or app. Right. To get started you need to download the link below. I'll put a link of the Omega file below this video All right so first thing you need to do is you need to put the phone into the recovery mode so that means you need to have the CWM recovery as well installed when you uh, root your phone so let's get started so what you have to do is you need to hold the, the power button the up volume button and also the home button all at the same time right so that's the recovery mode right here so to get started you need to wipe the data and also reset to factory settings so we use the the volume button the down volume button to navigate to wipe the data All right here we go so wipe data in factory settings click that one okay so you scroll down to delete all user data click the power button to confirm that option and I will start deleting the user data so it's all deleted now the next thing to do is to start the installation so you scroll down to install zip from SD card click confirm and I have my date I'm um, have my um, the room on the external SD so I choose zip from external SD confirm it and it's located in the download folder so I click the download folder and that's the first option right there and 7100 Omega version 17 right so I confirm that one then select yes to confirm the installation now the installation process will begin okay here we go right so this one is a, a graphic card interface installation so you click the next button right there and I'll do a wipe again so full wipe click next to confirm okay I have my device back up already so I don't need to back it up again so what I'll do is I'll, you select the do not back up you press the next button and install Omega ROM the first option click next and I'll go with the default installation I just said uh, all these will be installed as well so I'll just click next and this will start the process okay the process will take a while so uh, you can take this opportunity to like the video and also subscribe all right so now you click the next button and then reboot the device
Right. So it's all done. So this one is just the basic setup that we have to go through. So what I'll do is I'll skip this. Do just a normal setup. No, not now. Next. Next. No. Right, so your Omega installation is all done now. Here you go, as you can see, you can see the Omega wallpaper at the background. Let's go to settings to check the about device. And as you can see, there you go, Omega version 70 right there. There you go. So what I'll do is uh, I'll make another video of the overview of this uh, room so if you like this video please like and subscribe All right thank you for watching I'm out